so yeah, speaking of, well, I think we mentioned earlier that we got an Ant Man on the Wasp trailer uh, yesterday. Uh, you said you had you'd already seen it. You yeah. said you had kind of like half seen it. Yeah, I haven't seen it at all. So I, was, I, I wanted no, to, no, I haven't seen it at all. I wanted to do a trailer reaction, and I've just run short on time. So what I wanted to do is just do it right now and and go through the trailer. Can you see Nick? Yep. Well, yeah. I've seen it. A oh, times. yeah, bro. <laughs> so, well, yeah, we're just going to get a watch once. Minute, and 40, <laughs> minute and 41 seconds. So, real quick, we are going to run through this and then oh, we will. New York. Okay. Then so, we will discuss. No, that's, that's San, San Francisco. 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 <laughs> My next guess. <laughs> All right, here we go. Hey, what's that tower up there? That Stark Tower? <laughs> oh, hold on. Sorry. Sorry, everybody. <laughs> you got an ad going on? No, no, no. It's, no, no, it's, it's the podcast. <laughs> Let me uh, let me mute us for. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> it's so good. <laughs> All right. I was like, that sounds like me. All right. Civil War. I'm so excited about this movie. Sounds like the Power Rangers music. Oh. <laughs> Dude, Michael Douglas Dude, is so good. Yes. How did he install those wheels? Dude. Good point. On that building. That oh, Lawrence there. Fishburne. Yeah, that was Lawrence. Morpheus. What? He's playing Goliath. Right. I was curious to see if they alluded. Oh, Jai Ant Man. Wait, who was that? That's Ghost. That was, that was ghost. ghost. Yeah. Dude. You think she becomes an Avenger? Like a full-fledged Avenger? No. Probably. And then oh, see you? Dude, that's awesome. Yeah. Dude. <laughs> Michael Douglas. Dude, I saw a lot of people online hated on this. The logo? Yeah. Dude, giant Hello Kitty Pez dispenser. Are they keeping that in theme with, with Deadpool? Who knows, man. Uh, that was... Dude, I like that a lot. Kind of bring them together a little bit. I don't know. <laughs> what, with the Pez dispenser? Well, just the Hello Kitty part. Oh, that's right. Yeah, for, yeah. That was his. That was the only person he was following on Twitter during that whole campaign for the advertising of that movie. <laughs> was he really the Hello. only follower that he, or the only person he followed, was Hello Kitty? Dude, Ryan Reynolds. He's dude. He's so smart. He uh, he's a genius when it comes. Dude, to Dude, so like uh, what did we what did we think, guys? I I mean, so, um, so Scott Lang is under house arrest, basically. Or he's getting, yeah from uh, Civil War. Not for long. I hope, he had, I hope he references orange slices. That's my favorite line <laughs> in Civil War. Like, by, like, bar none, that's my favorite part is, you know, he goes, Anybody giant man. orange slices? <laughs> Dude, yeah. You know, it's funny. I made the I made the correlation. Um, I was like, okay, so the best part of Civil War, I mean, in my opinion, was the airport scene. And the oh, best yeah. part of the airport scene is is him becoming giant man. So I was like, He's kind of the best part of Civil War, and I mean the way you could sort of look at Black it. Black Panther's pretty great. Spider Man. No, I, I'm just, I'm just, I'm that just saying is like the way you can sort of think about it that way. I'm not saying that it is. I'm just saying it, you can think of it that way. Every moment he was in was was awesome. Though. Yeah, they had, really that, that, they had quick, that van quick joke, and he's like, "Hey, oh wow, Captain America! Hey, <laughs> <laughs> your shield, Captain America!" <laughs> you know, he throws the he throws the gas. Oh, truck yeah, he's like, that was a water truck. This. He throws it. In the, yeah, I thought that was a water truck, <laughs> dude. He is so funny, I got man. My Civil War that game dude, now. that's poor great. war machine. Just took all that, dude. Right? That's well, he's okay now because he's in the trailer for uh, Infinity War. So I guess he got his legs back. We think. We think. Yeah, it could be just a robot. Could be. Uh, uh, what are those aliens called? Could be a scroll. Uh, scroll. scroll. Yeah, yeah, it could be a scroll. There's so many possibilities. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna go with it's Rudy. Who knows? Uh, but no, just to um, be the realist again. It's just dude, I, dude, I, I want to watch it again, but I know we don't really have time. Um, uh, it's interesting to see. Um, mute that joint. Uh, the timeline. So I guess this t- this is going to because you know you don't see 
This well, movie no, doesn't you, come out until after Infinity War. It does not, but I think it's going to take place pre Civil or pre Infinity War. Really? Infinity War. I think so. Either that, or I think I might have told you this. I think I might have said this to you, Garrett. Um, I could definitely see, just like how we sort of had um, in Civil War, we had Ant Man and sort of like that one moment during the airport mm-hmm. scene, and then he kind of like goes off and does his own thing. I could see Ant Man sort of like popping up in moments of Infinity War, and then sort of like the events of Ant Man and the Wasp kind of taking place, kind of like. On the other side of town, while Infinity War is going on, I don't know. I don't know. I'm curious to find out where it fits in. Yeah, um, because these all these Marvel movies kind of jump around in, in do. time and space now. I know you just watched it, but if you when you rewatch that trailer again, there's no mention of any other Marvel character or reference I, or anything like that. That's a good point. So it's like a standalone movie. I'm okay with I, that. I the the first Ant Man movie was kind of the same way. There really was no mention of. I mean, they kind of mentioned Stark a couple of times. They're like that Stark tech. Yeah. Um, a couple of times. Well, well, we got Falcon. We did get Falcon. I forgot about that. No, that's true. But they, I was they thinking the Avengers base. He goes, "You're making me rock an Avengers base." <laughs> yeah. So yeah. I mean, that was he's like, he's like, I, I fought an Avenger. <laughs> yeah. Um, dude. Oh man, I'm so excited. Paul Red's so good, man. And uh, the, but the, what this does though is this makes me more just even more excited for Infinity War because you know he's going to be in there at some point. Um, well, we know he's in Avengers Four because we got the still shots. Oh yeah, we did. Yeah, we know he's in that. Um, Dude, you know the that's the bad thing about us. That's the bad thing about a giant cinematic universe is it's so easy to realize that the stakes really aren't that high because you know this character is going to be in the next movie. Right. So like you don't really have to worry about him that much. Though I do think we will lose a couple of characters in Infinity War, but I don't Cap. think I don't think it's going to be. Uh, Hey, man. Hoping for Cap. Think Cap's going down. I hope so. I think it could be. Love Chris Evans. Think he was like, he does a great job with the role. I'm so tired of him. Maybe it's because I don't like Captain America the First Avenger. <laughs> Maybe that's why I'm like, yeah. you just down really hate Fantastic Four. And it's he bad. is the human torch. Yeah. Yeah. So, there you go. He's like, but, whoa. Uh, <laughs> what, uh, what did you guys think about the. Ant Man and the Wash trailer. Be sure to let us know in the comments me. below. I was like, oh, that was good. <laughs> <laughs> the, I like Michael the, Pena was in there. Was just, he really? Just a brief second, so he's gonna show up at some point. Dude, what if he? Was well, I like that we actually got that brief glimpse of Lawrence Fishburne. As I, I'm curious to see what they do with Goliath. him at all because yeah, I hope it's blue and yellow. I know yeah. Goliath. I from what I know, Goliath sort of has similar abilities. Uh, he was a he was. Uh, Basically, like perfected. The he was Giant particles. Man at one point in the comics. He was like yeah. the official Giant Man. So, uh, and then they killed him in the original Civil War. Yeah, I believe. Yep. Spoiler. So, Gotta put a spoiler. Yeah, spoiler alert. alert. Um, we've already passed. That's been years ago. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, I thought they might have done something similar in the Civil War, uh, Captain America Civil War movie with Ant Man since they made him big and you know Goliath died in the comic books, but they never yeah. even mentioned. Him. Yeah, we're gonna get a mention of him now. <laughs> but, um, there's also another interesting fact from there too. Uh, you know Claire from Daredevil and yeah. Yeah. the Netflix mm-hmm. uh, Marvel she? series. Well, in the comics, she's married to Goliath. So there's a, oh. but I don't think they're gonna play it out that way. I, I, I honestly I don't feel like think they're gonna keep it separate. I don't universe. think you're gonna get any ties. I wish to, we would to man. the Netflix universe. In, I don't think any, any of them the could movies. do anything in like the. It would be cool to still. Like it'd be cool to. It'd be like the ultimate like fan too. service. Well, sick. they all have. It's written in their contract that they they have been used for. A I'm sure. I'm movie. sure it is, but I, dude, they just keep yeah. Danny Rand out. I'm, I'm cool. Yeah. But anyways, yeah, like I said, what did you guys think about the trailer? Be sure to let us know in the comments below.